I felt a great disturbance in the force, as if millions of voices suddenly cried out in terror and were suddenly silenced. I fear something terrible has happened. Welcome everyone, this is Master's Joke, also Master's Joke 75 on Instagram. So it's Wednesday the 4th of September 2024, it's the last day of lame in St. Evanage um, being in operation. They close their doors at 6 o'clock tonight and that's it. I wasn't going to go, um, I, you know, <laughs> I, I bought half of the Star Wars figures that they had in there so there's not much stock left. But um, Black Dad Ewoks, his, his comment on my last lame video was playing on my mind about those bargains and about Marion from Indiana Jones. Um, and also um, another um, subscriber and viewer of mine, great supporter of the channel, Julianne, she was like, yeah, you're going to go there on Wednesday. And I, w I wasn't, I honestly wasn't going to go, but I'm in the area and I thought, <laughs> why not? But there wasn't one single Star Wars figure in there. Not not one Star Wars figure at all. All of them are gone. It, uh, yeah, to be fair, there was there was hardly anything left after I'd uh, finished buying most of the stock up. But yeah, um, I just I just felt the need to go, and I still think it's really sad that um, that you know that the local branch of uh, Lame is closing down. I mean, it's you know, it's I've bought some, I've bought some really decent figures in there over the years, and um, yeah, the, the 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 town centre just won't be the same. It just won't be the same without it, you know. Um, a very emotional day. So, what did I actually pick up in Lame on the final day in Saint Evanage? So, yeah, as I, as I, well, as you probably saw in the footage. Very slim pickings. There was there was hardly anything there, whatsoever. No Star Wars fi figures at all. I asked the guy behind the counter just in case there was like a you know a box, you know, just in case there was a mad rush. But he said everything's gone. They were closing at six o'clock, and uh, and that was the uh, that was the end of it. So I double checked. Well, this is basically what I got. Blacked out Ewoks, I picked up Marion. Because I, I love these Indiana Jones retro figures. But you just can't, you know, you just can't have everything. So that's why I've not picked them up before. I've only I've only had one I I only I initially bought the Indiana Jones figure from Star Action Figures, the one from um Raiders of the Lost Ark. So he, I've got him on card. Uh, but I thought that's it. That's that's all I can really do because you've got to choose which uh, figure line you want to buy because I don't have the cash to to splash on everything. But seeing these guys, because I've not really had a proper look at them, and then what Julianne and also Black Dad Ewoks Bo said <laughs> those sleepless nights. Yeah, no, I did. I did have one or two sleepless nights thinking about. Um, lame and uh, you know what bargains I'm missing out on um, so yeah I popped in there checked with them that, that Marion was still £10 and yeah she was and um, yeah so I picked her up for, for a fiver uh, when, I, when I went in there last week the last time I went in there there was I think there was three Marions there's also a short round as well and then these two guys that I picked up um, so there was only two Marions and I, I picked them both up. So the cards, they're not in the best, because I'm going to open one of these up. The cards aren't in the best condition. Um, I'd say this one's, <laughs> this one's the best. It's got, a little, it's got a little ding on the corner there. Um, I'd say this one's, yeah, this one's got a kind of, um, oh no, this, this one here, this one's got the, uh, Looks like the sticker, if you can see there, just under the uh, £12 sticker. It's kind of got a little bit of, um, looks like a bit of the card back has been taken off by another sticker. So I'd say this one is the best, uh, the best condition card back. But for £5, I should have bought this when I went there last week for five quid. I wasn't sure that Marion looked like a, a great figure, if I'm honest. That's, that's what kind of put me off, even though I knew she was a fiver. 
But I didn't realise, because I did I did a little bit of research, I didn't realise that there was a, a little <laughs> the little monkey, you know, the little the little monkey bad dates. So the little monkey's included, and I never knew that, so the monkey alone's worth five pounds. And talking of bad dates, <laughs> I actually uh I actually had a not, a not a date, you know, you know the the, the the dates like in Indiana Jones. I had a date today, and it was really nice. It was like eating a fruit cake. I don't think I've ever eaten dates before, but yeah, so I'm, I'm quite happy with this. So I'm going to be opening, probably opening up this one. Um, but I, but you know, since they had the the 25% um, discount, I saw uh, the Pat Roach figure um, from a We the Same Pet. You know the guy. The Nazi who um, who Indiana Jones had a fight with in uh, Raiders of the Lost Ark, and um, he kind of got destroyed by the propeller, and you see all the blood. So he's a figure that I'd like to pick up, and um, yeah, there's there's a few, but I I was having a look on um, in demand toys, and they've got a few of the Indiana Jones uh, figures for sale. And the thing is, you'll see these at full price. Because I think they're cheaper online. I think they're cheaper on the on the lame website. But I think it's um, I think it's definitely um, it's definitely an action figure line. I wouldn't mind picking up a few more of the figures. Even I, I don't know what they call them, but you know the Black Series style figures for Indiana Jones. Even even they look good. I mean, I was tempted to buy them, but I didn't want to kind of go down a another action figure line. Um, but I, I still love this one because. I, you know, Raiders of the Lost Ark was great, but when I saw uh, uh, Temple of Doom actually in the cinema, it just blew me away. I absolutely loved it, and especially this scene. This this is obviously the scene on the bridge, which was filmed in Elstree at Elstree Studios outside. So um, yeah, I'm I'm really happy. <laughs> I'm really happy. I went back, picked up two Marion's ten pounds. Let your eyes be your guide, but. But I spoke to the guys in game because um, obviously, um, you know, if you follow my channel, you, you'll be aware of um, the altercation I had with uh, Daniel from customer services online at Lame. Um, but, you know, that's all in the past. The actual physical shops, the guys there are just lovely, really, really nice guys. And I've never had an issue with anyone in any of the game stores. I, game is a fantastic shop and it's... It's such a shame that the uh, it is such a shame that the the local um, Saint Evanage branch, where I've bought so many figures over the years, is uh, is no more, and will not you know they're going to pull the whole place down. But I spoke to the guys and uh, the new Sports Direct, and I haven't seen it yet. But the new Sports Direct that they apparently the guys were saying that um, they moved very quickly, and it's going to be re it's going to be opened uh, next week. On the Roaring Meg, and obviously they're going to have all the latest stuff, and all the you know all the retro collection figures, and uh, I'm looking out for a couple of HK87 Assassin droids for Chuffy Futter. So um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. So you know, rest in peace, game in Saint Evanage, but bring it on, Sports Direct with a smaller scale lame on the Roaring Meg. Um, but yeah, so, you know, so <laughs> every cloud has a silver lining. I've got two Marians. I look forward to opening them up. I look forward to picking up more of these figures. And I look forward to uh, visiting the brand new lame on the Roaring Meg next week during my lunch break. I mean, you, you can't get better than that, can you? But before, before I go, um, I want to say um, a big shout out to... Uh, <laughs> To my good friend uh, Ed in New York, so uh, so Ed, big supporter of the channel, um, and he's he sent me many a figure, um, Star Wars related, um, a top guy, but he's he's not being well. He's in hospital at the moment. So big shout out to Ed. I hope you start feeling better soon. And also uh, Black Dad Ewoks. He is um, he's basically a Star Wars. Um, Original line, action figure, king. Yeah, he, he, you know he knows everything about it. He's got a fantastic channel on YouTube, so definitely check him out. 
blacked out Ewoks. But that is the uh, <laughs> that is the end of the video. Um, yeah, apologies for the lighting, but it's um, it's dark. <laughs> I didn't think I was going to make a video today because I I um I had no plans to go to uh, to Lame. But anyway, that is the end of the video. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Um, I've you know I videoed game on its final day. I mean, I probably you know let's be honest. I probably, I, it was probably me who made the last purchase in uh, in Lame in St. Evanage. You know, I, I, <laughs> that's my story and I'm sticking to it. But yeah, that is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It lets me know you care. It also helps the channel. Yeah, they're the other figures that I need. So yeah, def definitely need um, the German guy with a burnt hand. I can't, what, what's his name? Tot, uh, Pat Roach, the uh, mechanic, Belloc, and Belloc was in what film was he in? Belloc was in the Long Good Friday. Yeah, he was. I think he was in the opening scene, and then of course uh, Marion Ravenwood. And isn't there talk that she was underage when? Uh, Indy actually met up with her the first time around. Who knows? But yeah, that, that is the end of the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It lets me know you care. It also helps the channel, and I'll see you in the next one. This is the story of Raiders of the Lost Ark. You can read along with me in your book. You will know it is time to turn the page when you hear the bullwhip crack like this. Let's begin now.